Good afternoon and welcome. It is with great joy that we come here together today to celebrate the marriage of Ernest and Ashley. You have been always very good friends since you start dating and you have decided to make the choice to love each other in a new way. You have been waiting for this day for so long. <laughs> As you are both lawyers, I know you both love the law. You believe that law is the fundamental of life and liberty. Oh, law is fascinating. However, I want to conclude by sharing this with you. A sacramental marriage is a covenant, not a contract. A contract is written on paper. A covenant is written on one's heart. Ernest and Ashley, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourself to each other in marriage? We have. Will you love and honor each other as man and wife for the rest of your lives? We will. Will you accept children lovingly from God and bring them up according to the law of Christ and His church? We will. Ashley, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. Ernest, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. And now, Ernest, you can kiss the bride. <laughs> <laughs> Today, we stand at another new beginning as Ashley and EJ start a new life together. Although they've been together for years, today changes things.
We do want to congratulate EJ on welcoming him back into the family now that he has married a University of Florida graduate. Go Gators! All jokes aside, with EJ by her side, there's a great balance. He's the messy to her neurotic cleanliness, the chill to her stress, the chef to her only make food so I don't die cooking abilities. Ashley has always been a kind, generous, and compassionate soul motivated to take on uh, big challenges and excel. We are excited that she has found a husband in EJ who also is kind, generous, compassionate, and motivated. Ashley called me the week before EJ proposed. She was suspicious of him, detailing his every move, her every move mulling over what she would do if he so happened to pop the question because he was being weirder than normal. Before EJ did propose, she already knew she'd say yes. There's never been a doubt in her mind, and I know that e Ashley and EJ will continue to say yes to all their new adventures. And I'm so happy I could be here with them today to say congratulations, finally, to Mr. and Mrs. Cox. This is a long time coming and I couldn't be more happy to congratulate my brother EJ and his now wife, finally, Ashley, into the family. Congratulations, guys. I love you.